OMV, one of the largest international gas producers in Pakistan, is operating in the remote Nara Desert in the Kherpur and Sakkar districts of Sindh. With its vast stretches of sand dunes, Nara Desert is both a place of great natural beauty and a harsh, unforgiving land in seasons of drought. The majority of people live where there is water available for cultivation. Animal herding is another important source of livelihood. Its remoteness combined with years of neglect has left the area underdeveloped and lacking in most basic facilities. With the commitment to improve the lives of those living around its area of operation, OMV started the Community Development or CD program in the year 2001. a worldwide operating oil and gas company and we in OMV we are convinced that we can carry out our activities successfully only if we do this in harmony with, our, with the environment of our operations. Especially OMV Pakistan endeavors to contribute towards the development of the areas of operation. We try to do this by designing and funding need-based projects with special focus on education health, water and energy supply, but also agriculture and income generation. OMV believes that community development is a process which increases the capacity of local people to develop their own solutions and needs based on their own needs and priorities. Our approach is based on community participation, enhancing the capacity of local people and developing the partnership and resources with local community. We try to take those initiatives which not only benefit the local community but also leave sustainable footprints. Near a busy road, this courtyard with two rooms is the only school that the children here have attended. But soon they will be studying in their brand new school with proper classrooms and a playground. The new school will be like this one in village Muhammad Baksh Panbro. Here the improved school building and educational environment have led to a rapid increase in enrollment. <laughs> फिर इस इसमें कोई इनोलमेंट जो बढ़ गई फर्क ये लगा है लोगों में दिलचस्पी आई है उन्होंने अपने बच्चे को इनोल कराया है 12 year old Rahman is visiting his parents at the weekend during the week he stays with relatives in a town 3 hours away from home where he attends school जब मैं शुरू में गांव में था तब यहां हमारे गांव में स्कूल सिर्फ पांचवी जमात तक था और मैं मैंने सोचा मैं आगे पढूंगा और फिर मैं चुन कर चला गया पढ़ाई के लिए वहां मैं पाकिस्तान रेंजर्स पब्लिक स्कूल में पढ़ता हूं टुडे इज एग्जाम डे एट द पाकिस्तान रेंजर्स पब्लिक स्कूल सपोर्टेड बाय ओएमवी it has been established as a model school. Here children are given quality education at par with any good school in the big cities. This has helped overcome many traditional barriers to education. पहले ये होता था कि हमारे पास girls ज़्यादा से ज़्यादा आप समझें कि 50 थी number of girls. लेकिन now we have more than 200 girls. तो वो इस वजह से possible हुआ है कि जब लोगों ने देखा कि वाकई यहाँ पे माहौल अच्छा है, लड़कियाँ हमारी पढ़ सकती हैं, उनमें awareness एक पैदा हुई है. इस वजह से अब देखें कि दूर-दूर से यहाँ पे teachers भी आई हैं, female teachers. तो वो जब देखते हैं कि जब if they can live 
इतना दूर अपने घर से रह सकती हैं तो हमारी बच्चियां यहां पे क्यों नहीं पढ़ सकती बेरेज रहमान हैज रिलेटिव्स विद होम ही कैन स्टे इन टाउन एंड अटेंड स्कूल द मेजॉरिटी ऑफ चिल्ड्रन कम फ्रॉम रिमोट विलेजेस एंड फॉर देयर फैसिलिटेशन द स्कूल आल्सो प्रोवाइड्स देम ट्रांसपोर्ट यहां पे लोग अफोर्ड भी कर सकते हैं कि अपने बच्चों को डेली आप भेजो क्योंकि दे आर वर्किंग वो काम करते हैं मजदूरी करते हैं उनके पास इतना टाइम नहीं होता है कि अपने बच्चों को स्कूल लेके आओ फिर वापस लेके जाओ तो इस वजह से ट्रांसपोर्ट जो है हमारा बहुत जो समझे कि बहुत अहम रोल अदा कर रहा है बच्चों की यहाँ पे लाने में ओ एम पी पाकिस्तान इज सपोर्टिंग सिक्सटी फोर प्राइमरी स्कूल विदोपरेशन ऑफ द लोकल कम्युनिटी एंड द डिस्ट्रिक्ट एजुकेशन डिपार्टमेंट Almost 3000 children are enrolled in these schools. The Citizens Foundation or TCF is one of the country's great success stories in providing quality education to children from lower income groups. With the belief that children no matter where they live deserve the best possible education. OMV has collaborated with TCF to build a school here. Many settlements in the Miano area do not have schools because of the scattered and semi-nomadic nature of the population. Although parents of this village thought education was important for their children's future, it hadn't been much of a priority for them. OMV's community development team was successful in mobilizing the villagers to set up this thatched hut school. The establishment of such hut schools was made possible with the partnership of the community, the District Education Department Sakhar and OMV. In winters, going to school can be as simple as sitting together, enjoying the warm sun while learning your math lesson. but the teachers have to make an effort to ensure that all children do attend school to taqriban 30 ghar jo hain wo bacche bhejte hain aur aise 30 dusre bhi honge wo nahi bhejte hain uski wajah ye hai ki wo kuch to aise garib hain aur jo bacche bhejte hain to usko maal jo hai wo uska kaam kaun kare another challenge is to find qualified teachers willing to work in the tough living conditions of this remote desert area local teachers were thus hired trained and appointed in the network of schools supported by OMV formal teacher training sessions are held twice a year during school vacations master trainers from renowned institutes conduct the training along with the trained local instructors from the training resource center or trc set up by omv to develop human resource in the field of education these teachers are working in an environment where women are not allowed to venture out too far from their homes to facilitate them to attend these full day trainings they sit in a separate room and are encouraged to bring their children along other than these sessions The teachers are also getting school-based support by a team of qualified teacher trainers. Teachers ki musalsal aur baqayda tarbiyat ke liye koshishein ki gayi uske baad jiski bina pe TRC ka qiyam amal mein aaya jo education department ki madad se banaya gaya. Aur inhi education department yani assistant district education office ki office mein hi uska qiyam amal mein aaya. ताकि एक तसलसल कायम रहे काम का ओ एम वी वालों की मॉनिटर बहुत अच्छी है मॉनिटरिंग जो होती है वो स्कूलों को मॉनिटर करते हैं टाइम पे पहुंच जाते हैं उनको चेक करते हैं टाइम पे आना टाइम पे जाना उनकी रेगुलरिटी मैं एग्ज़ाम लेता हूं तो एग्ज़ाम में इनका बच्चा जो है कंपनी वाले स्कूलों का बहुत अच्छा आता है जी हाँ वो फ़र्क दिखाता है और अच्छी तरह स्कूलों को ये इक्वमेंट करते हैं कंपनी वालों अच्छे ये बिल्डिंग बनाई है अच्छी अच्छी बिल्डिंग बनवाई है अच्छा अच्छा फर्नीचर मुहैया किया है और ये मतलब टीचर क्वालिटी को ध्यान में रखते हैं कि जब टीचर का सिलेक्शन करते हैं तो इंटरव्यू करते हैं एक अच्छा क्वालिफाइड टीचर और अच्छा परफॉर्मेंस देने वाला को ये मंतखब कर लेते हैं
A unique feature of some parts of the Nara Desert is the shifting populations in changing seasons. As winter makes way for summer, the people move with their livestock and belongings to hutments closer to vegetation and sources of water. Water is a precious commodity here. Not just for the local communities, but also for their livestock, a valuable source of income. During the dry hot summers, the search for water can mean travelling for more than half a day. Over the years, as most wells in Miano dried up, people here faced great hardships. As an immediate solution, the water supply scheme brings water within close distance to the villages. A water tanker fills up these tanks placed within a kilometre from the villages on a daily basis. In areas where there is groundwater available, hand pumps have been provided. In this village, Mohammed Banani Zamani, the groundwater had become brackish. To address the problem, groundwater surveys were conducted. After fresh water was found three kilometers away on the lands of a village elder, a piped water scheme was set up with the involvement of the community. Hepatitis is among the most dangerous of diseases and its spread needs to be checked. You see, we would like to ensure and uh, lead the people in, in, in this area to uh, live a healthier life. Especially hepatitis is a, is a big problem in this area and this is why we carry out a large uh, hepatitis prophylaxis project which is specially funded by uh, OMV Austria and the Austrian Development Agency. This project includes the screening and vaccination of about 9,000 women and children in this area. The villagers are informed two days prior to the screening and vaccination camp. On that day, an awareness session is held separately for men and women. Here the villagers are informed about the causes of the disease, how to prevent it and what is to be done if it is contracted. This project is unique in this way that we have been able to get from 0 to 14 years के बच्चों और बच्चियों दोनों को स्क्रीनिंग और वैक्सीन कर कर रहे हैं और 14 साल से लेके 40 साल तक की खावातीन को भी हम इसमें स्क्रीनिंग और वैक्सीन कर रहे हैं जो के पाकिस्तान में बल्कि एशिया लेवल पे कहीं पे भी नहीं हो रहा। Throughout the process of blood screening and vaccination, high standards of hygiene are maintained. All used syringes are disposed of, and at the end of the day. The refuse is taken away to be incinerated. With no roads or public transport, getting to a medical facility for minor ailments is not easy. To fulfill this essential need, 26 village health centers have been set up, where communities have easy access to a trained dispenser and basic medicine. The community takes the responsibility for maintaining these clinics. Mothers need special care. In Pakistan, the maternal mortality rate is very high. One major reason for this is the lack of available facilities near home. With the establishment of the Mother and Child Health Centre in Saleh Pat, in partnership with District Government Sakkar and Mari Stop Society, 
women from far-off villages come here and are attended by qualified medical staff. इसका मकसद बनाने का यहाँ था कि पहले यहाँ पे इन लोगों ने जब सर्वे किया तो यहाँ पे पता चला कि माँ की शरा इमवाद और बच्चे की शरा इमवाद बहुत ज़्यादा थी तो उस वजह से यहाँ पे जो कमेंट्स आए थे लोगों के और जो पता चला था इनके सर्वे के मुताबिक कि यहाँ पे कोई ऐसा हॉस्पिटल नहीं था जिसमें माँ और बच्चे की जान को बचाया जा सके देंटर हैज एन ऑपरेशन थिएटर विदेस्ट इक्विपमेंट फॉर इमरजेंसी सर्जरीज This was needed because women are usually brought here at a crucial stage when the traditional birth attendants or dais are unable to deliver their babies at home. काफी ऐसे होते हैं कहते हैं कि हम जहां पे शायद यानी रोड्स भी नहीं बने हुए उन लोगों के यहां ना पूरा रेगिस्तान है ये है तो वो कहते हैं हम कैसे आए कोई गधे गाड़ियों पे आते हैं कोई ट्रैक्टर पे आते हैं कुछ कुछ तो हम लोगों ने ट्रैक्टर पे ही जैसे यहाँ तक पहुँचा है अभी मेन गेट तक तो हमने वहाँ पे डिलीवरीज करवाई हैं गधे गाड़ियों पे डिलीवरीज करवाई हैं हमने अ डिस्पेंसरी इन मियानो डील्स विद इमरजेंसी एंड फर्स्ट एड केसेस इट इज कनेक्टेड विद द मदर एंड चाइल्ड हेल्थ सेंटर थ्रू एन एम्बुलेंस सर्विस द डिस्पेंसरी इज प्रोवाइडेड इलेक्ट्रिसिटी थ्रू सोलर पावर It is also equipped with a solar refrigerator for the refrigeration of essential medicines. Today is a special day in this village. After years of living without electric power, finally the village has electricity connections and today the villagers are celebrating with an inaugural ceremony. OMV's commitment towards the community extends in all areas from education, health and provision of water to income generation through new agro technology. This fruit demonstration farm orchard is being grown on an experimental basis to give the farmers here an alternative source of income. to encourage women to use their traditional skills for their own income a handicraft project has been introduced where the women's embroidered work is sold at national and international exhibitions without them having to go through the middlemen and similarly a skill and craft development center has been set up to help young women learn sewing and embroidery to give them a means to create their own earnings as it continues to grow omv's community development program has helped make a difference to the lives of its neighboring communities with its sustainable development initiatives omv operates by joining hands and moving together towards a brighter future